What is up guys, welcome to the video. First things first, I just wanna say thank you for all the support that we got on the alloy video. I thought it was gonna be a very touch and go kind of color and a lot of people weren't gonna like it, but turns out a lot of you guys thought they looked amazing, which I'm so happy about because I do as well. But now we've had the alloys done, this red sun strip doesn't really match in. So we're down here at image window tinting and he's gonna sort me out a new sun strip. Uh, and I think I'm gonna go a bit leery and have gold writing on the middle. So we're going for a satin black sun strip with, uh, with gold writing and then when we get home i've got a mugen spoiler that is ready to go on the car so fingers crossed we get all this done today and it doesn't absolutely smash it down because the weather's been awful recently but yeah we're here at image window tinting let's get the sun strip installed where is he here he is hey. how you doing What's you? good man good is this the gold glitter we're going huh? is this this gold glitter yeah well they're two bit long gold gold oh they're mint gold. <laughs> i like that oh you've got gold it's just gold Oh, you got rose gold. Oh, you got gold. Oil slick. Rose gold oil slick. Oh god, I like the. I, I think I like the gold oil slick. That's too, when it said rose gold, this is rose gold. That's too pink. It's very pink, isn't it? Very pink. I like it. Oh, yeah. But it's very pink. Yeah, well, I like that. I like that. Definitely that one. So yeah, like I said, we're gonna go for a satin black sun strip wherever that is. I think he's already got it sorted here. Satin black sun strip with a gold sticker on it. I'm not even sure what I'm gonna have on the gold sticker yet, but. We'll, we'll sort something out. Oh shit. <laughs> <laughs> stuck under the car. stuck, oh my god. Oh, this was that bottle, Come here, you. <laughs> yeah, lad, free sun strip. <laughs> oh, it does look fresh. Adam Ivor is going to love me. Look at that. I might end up changing that to a wax and away one and getting rid of that one, but for now, that does look really good and it complements the wheels really nice as well. Looks a lot better than the red one, 100%. Uh, I'm going to go ahead and uh, give it a little pressure wash and I want to just do a little before and after. I've not washed these wheels yet because obviously you've got them painted and uh, I had to wait 48 hours before I can actually do anything. It's been about 3-4 days now so this is what they look like before. I'm going to give the car a wash and show you what they look like after. It's weird how good these come up. Much better, much better. Oh, I'm actually sick of it now. It's come to the point where it's not even like fun. I literally just said while we're sat in there, I bet you it rains now, now I've washed my car and it's freaking raining. Hopefully this Mugen spoiler's arrived. It's not looking good on, is it Herms, Hermes? Oh, it's not looking good on there either. So we'll probably just have to pick this video up another day when, once, they, uh, once the spoiler arrives. But I can't believe it's flipping raining, man. Right. I said home. Tis the morning after, and we've had some deliveries. So this one should be from Tegwa. I'm, I'm just gonna have to apologize for the light because it keeps flickering on and off, but this should be from Tegwa. They sent me this out, and I'm so grateful for it. Huge shout out to Johnny and Jim at Tegwa. Oh, look at this, man. So it's a massive interior, Jesus Christ, it's about as big as a number plate. So it's a big interior mirror, um, rear view mirror. And you can literally see like out all your blind spots through this, it's actually amazing. So I'm gonna install this on the car, it's really, really simple. You quite literally just clip it onto your original mirror. So uh, look, you can see yourselves. But yeah, this is going to be awesome. It's really big. I'm going to, I can't wait to get this on the car. I think it's going to change the game. It's going to change the game. As you can see, it's a JDM mirror. It's all in Japanese. Huge shout out to Tegwa. All links in the description. Thank you so much, Jim, for sending me this out. You're actually a legend, mate. I appreciate it so much. Okay. Time for the big one. We've got a Mugen wing for the EP3. 
Broke a bit of a sweat then getting that one done. Right, let's uh, let's get this on the car. I'm really looking forward to this. I hope it looks as good as I think because I had the Mugen grill. Uh, and I know a load of people have been asking me in the comments about the Mugen grill that I had. I had that and I just didn't take to it. I just didn't take to it. I just thought that the OEM one looked a lot better. But this being all already matched in cosmic grey, I hope it doesn't look too far from stock because if you know me, I really like how the EP3s look straight out the factory. So I don't want to go far and beyond that. But I think this will be a good touch. But I think first things first, we should put this on. <laughs> that sunstrip looks mega. Wow. Oh my god, that is a big, big difference. <laughs> oh Jesus. Right, let's get it done. Okay, that. <laughs> that is mint. I really like that. I, I know this is going to be one of them things that, um, whatever car I drive, I'm going to be like, oh, I need one of them mirrors. I need one of them mirrors. I can see, I can literally see everything. If you want one of them, go grab it off Tegwa in the description. They're, they're amazing. I really like them. I'm really, really, really... <laughs> I can see everything. I can see out the passenger. I can see there. I can actually see. Like, look, there's my hand. There's my hand on the wind. Oh, my God. That's amazing. Really happy with that. Right, let's get this wing installed. All right. We need to take, obviously, the original wing off. Now, this has got a little bit of damage on it. I'm not sure from what, but the new one uh, is going to look good. So, to get this off... I am 99% sure we've got a bolt here, a bolt here, and then under this plastic bit we've got four bolts, and then another two bolts this side. I'm pretty sure it's that easy. Let's just give it a go. Okay, so once you've took that plastic off, there's four bolts in here. There's one in there, one in there, one in there, one in there. Just be careful when taking them out. Make sure you're really careful that they don't fall down into your spoiler or boot or whatever, because then they're going to be rattling around. There's all four. Time to do the ones on the side. Look how weird this thing looks without a spoil. It looks so bad. <laughs> oh my God, it looks horrendous. Right, I'm gonna give it all a clean and uh, and then get ready to put the Mugen one on. I think this is gonna look amazing actually. Now I've took that one off. It looks very small and very standard and basic. Uh, I'm, I really think this is gonna look good. Right, gonna give it a clean and then get cracking. So here's a quick little side by side of the two and Jesus, there's actually such a big difference in the Mugen one is in size. Right, enough of that. Let's get it on the car. Okay, so this is really weird. From here, it kind of looks the complete wrong colour. Then from here, it looks perfect. That's weird, but it looks sick, so what's going on? <laughs> I don't really know, obviously, unless that's because obviously it's been freshly painted and that's old. Someone that works with bodywork, let me know, but from here it looks different. Especially from here, you can see it literally looks like two different colours. Then you come round here, and it's perfect. So, that's a weird one. If anyone knows, let me know. <laughs> me being me, I've gone and dropped a screw down there, that's what you just heard. Um, these three are in. <clears throat> just waiting on that one uh, and then I can't even I can't get the side ones in because these screws that I took out are, uh, are too 
like short so I'm gonna go to ants later uh, and I'm thinking he's got some longer screws but it looks good though it does look good I do like it okay so we're gonna add head to ants for two reasons one I'm hoping he's got the bolts that will fit uh, the new spoiler and two I'm getting the skunk 2 system taken off this because it is just obnoxiously loud it's it's like not really that fun to drive anymore because of how loud the exhaust is I know I should man up but it just is really really loud um, so we're going to be booked in we're going to get booked in at Zorse Works for a complete custom custom system but for now I think I've got an M2 system going on don't know who that is uh, we've got an M2 system going on that Ant's giving me and we'll get booked in at Zorse Works so yeah that's 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 that it, it's just too loud boys it's it's not nice to drive so yeah I'll pick the video up when we get to Ant's get that installed properly and go from there okay little bit of a hop skip jump in the video but i'm super happy with this now now it's all lined up now it's on properly uh, i absolutely love it the color's fine i just realized it's obviously fiberglass which is the same as the bumper so it's never going to be the exact perfect match to what the uh, the actual bodywork of the car is just because different material type it looks absolutely amazing like i said it's not I, I like the way it's all caught i like the way it's all cosmic gray as well so it don't look too far from stock at the minute it's on the highest uh, highest setting which i really like and we've got a little pea shooter on at the minute uh, like i said before the only reason we've changed that is because one and one of his skunk two back because it sounds amazing on his car and two i was looking at getting it off the car anyway because of just how loud and obnoxious it was even every time you put your foot down it was just so loud everyone was looking and it's kind of nice to be able to drive it and not every Everyone look at it just because of the sound but yeah we're going to be booking in with Zorse Works very soon for now we've got this little pea shooter on don't look too bad but it is what it is but yeah I'm going to go ahead and get some shots of the Mugen spoiler then we're going to wrap the video up So yeah, that's the Mugen spoiler, all done and installed, looking amazing, really glad I got one of these. I know a lot of you guys were telling me to get a Mugen spoiler, get a Mugen spoiler, and this is something that I actually do like and is going to stay on the car. So yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed the video, I hope you like it as much as I do. I'll catch you guys in the next one. Please remember to like, comment and subscribe. Peace.